Welcome to Infigyan, my dear friends. In this video, we have one very interesting and challenging question from system of equations. We have to find out all real x and y. Given equations are 9 over root x plus root y plus root x y equal to x plus y. And second equation is 1 over root x plus 1 over root y equal to 3 by 2. So let's get started by writing x should be positive, y should be positive for real solutions. Now I will use substitution. Let us consider x is equal to a square and y equal to b square. So I can write our equation 1 as 9 over square root x plus square root y. So it will become a plus b plus square root x times square root y so a times b equal to x plus y so a square plus b square now i will take away a b from both sides so 9 divided by a plus b equal to a square plus b square minus a b now cross multiply so I will write a plus b times a square plus b square minus ab. This is formula of a cube plus b cube equal to 9. Let me consider in this form only equation 1 I will call. Now I will simplify second equation. So let me write here equation 2. Here it is. Now x is a square, so I will write 1 over a plus 1 over b equal to 3 over 2. Take LCM, so a plus b over ab equal to 3 by 2. And a plus b I will write 3 by 2 times ab. This is our equation number 2. Let me write here our equation 1. It was a plus b times a square plus b square minus ab equal to 9. Now here I will be writing a plus b whole square and then minus 2ab and minus ab. So let me write in total minus 3ab. And here it is a plus b. RHS is 9. Now let us use equation number 2. a plus b equal to 3 by 2 ab. And let's consider ab equal to t. So I will write here 3 by 2 ab first. It is a plus b in bracket. 3 by 2 ab whole square and then I will be writing 3 ab equal to 9. Let's apply this ab equal to t substitution. So this equation let me cancel 3 and 9. Now this 2 I will take to the RHS. So I will write here ab times 9 by 4 a square b square minus 3 ab equal to 6. 3 times 2 is 6. Now let's apply ab equal to t. So t times 9 by 4 t square minus 3t equal to 6. Let me write t times 9 by 4 t square minus 3t equal to 6. Now t times 9 t square minus 12 t divided by 4 equal to 6. Multiply both sides by 4. t times 9 t square minus 12 t equal to 24. Let's multiply. So I will write 9t cube 
minus 12 t square and minus 24 now rhs will be 0 equation is divisible by 3 so 3 t cube minus 4 t square minus 8 equal to 0 this is one cubic equation and i will solve using rational loop and synthetic division theorem method so let us consider the eligible factors of constant written term 8 so i can write plus minus 1 plus minus 2 plus minus 4 and plus minus 8 similarly if i will write the factors of leading coefficient plus minus 1 plus minus 3 let us apply t equal to straight away minus 2 or let me plug in 2 first so 3 times 2 cube so i will write 8 minus 4 times 2 square so 4 minus 8 is this 0 24 minus 16 minus 8 yes 24 minus 24 equal to 0 that means t equal to 2 is our base solution now i will write all the coefficients of this cubic equation and i will find out the remaining factors or roots so let us write 3 minus 4 0 minus 8 3 minus 4 0 minus 8 are the coefficients of cubic equation and t equal to 2 is our base solution leading coefficient as it is now take product 3 times 2 is 6 6 minus 4 is 2 2 times 2 is 4 0 plus 4 is 4 2 times 4 is 8, minus 8 plus 8 is 0. So here we have factors or coefficients of quadratic equation. So let me write here 3t square plus 2t plus 4 equal to 0. I will check only discriminant for this quadratic equation. b square, so 2 square minus 4 times ac, 3 into 4. So this is nothing but 4 minus 12 times 4, 48. So it is giving us negative value, negative 44. So it will generate complex solutions. So I will reject this quadratic equation. Reject it for real solutions. Now which solution we are going to accept? It is t equal to 2, our base solution. And what was t? t was our substitution ab. So let me write here t equal to ab equal to 2. Now our second equation was, let me write here that equation a plus b equal to 3 by 2 ab. Let's apply AB equal to 2 here. So I can write A plus B equal to 3 by 2 times 2. So this will be 3 only. Now I can write one system where sum of roots A plus B is 3 and product of roots AB equal to 2. Let us frame one quadratic equation whose roots are a and b where sum of roots 3, product of roots 2. So I can write in a itself a square minus sum of roots. So 3 times a plus product of roots plus 2 equal to 0. Now I can easily factorize or I can apply quadratic formula. Let's apply formula minus b. So it will become plus 3 plus minus under the root b square so 9 minus 4ac so 8 divided by 2a so 2 so i can write 3 plus minus root 1 is 1 over 2 so we are having two values 4 over 2 and 2 over 2 it is 2 and 1 so let me write here a equal to 1 a equal to 2 now I can write straight away b value from here because 
b from this equation it is 2 over a so i can write b value equal to 2 over 1 so 2 and 2 over 2 so 1 so if i will write ordered pairs then it will be a comma b and here it is 1 comma 2 2 comma 1 so 1 2 and 2 comma 1 now we have to calculate x comma y. Let me write here a comma b. It is 1 comma 2 and 2 comma 1. Now x and y. If I will write x was a square and y was b square. So I will write x comma y as 1 square 2 square and 2 square 1 square so our final answer becomes x comma y it will be equal to 1 4 and 4 1 this is our final answer and this brings the end of this video thank you friends for watching do not forget to like share and subscribe bye bye till next video good luck take care of yourself bye bye